way. Okay. Against the like four foot handrail. Okay. All the way tight against it like this. What stage were you closest to? The main stage. Okay. This is the main stage. Okay. Um, we were right in front of where there's the two cameramen up here mm -hmm. and in front of the equipment booth, the sound guys or whatever. Okay. So we're like directly in front of that. Yeah, the corner. And then uh, first there was what sounded like firecrackers. Okay. Almost like it was like up in the air, like yeah. over us, like pop, 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 pop. Mm -hmm. Definitely like firecrackers. And then, and then you heard the multi-fire, you know, gunfire, like pop, 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 pop. Okay. You, and then you hear it, and then you look, and there's bodies dropping. A little girl, younger girl went down. Okay. She looked really bad. And the woman behind me, I turned to her and she's like, I've been shot. She was shot in the leg. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to help her. Mm -hmm. And then you heard the multiple shoots again. And mm -hmm. it's like, holy shit. So I got on top of her and covered her. Mm -hmm. And that's when I felt the ricochet. Me. Yeah. Okay. And that's when I felt that. And then some guy said, we got to get the hell out of here. Mm -hmm. So I jumped over the fence, mm -hmm. got her. She jumped over. Mm -hmm. um, and we ran. And we ran to the side exit. I assume by the bottom in the middle. Mm -hmm. I think that's where it was. But we were all, like, hundreds of people funneling through one little area. Okay. And uh, luckily nobody was panicking and pushing, but we got... I was going to say, it's lucky you guys were able yeah, to stay together. Yeah, everybody, they were saying, stay calm, stay calm, just go slow. Because at that point, we felt like we were far enough away, mm -hmm. and we started feeling safe, and then the shots happened again. Mm -hmm. So we funneled through, we got through the streets, and everybody just kept running, trying to get away as far as we could. Uh -huh. And then... Um, we went to a hotel, I don't know what it is. It seemed like a hotel, right? It was like, and people were breaking windows, trying to get into the room, pounding on doors. Nobody would let anybody in. Everybody just wanted to get out of this mm -hmm. exterior out of the hallways. Streets, yeah. yeah, we were in the hallways, but we wanted to get out and you know, surrounded by walls at least. Mm -hmm. So that the people were breaking yours. windows. Okay. Trying to get into people's hotel The Tropicana room. probably. Well, no, the tro th this one was really small. Okay. Yeah, it almost felt like a apartment kind of style, mm -hmm. like a motel. And then, um, continued on mm -hmm. we didn't feel safe there mm -hmm. and we just started kept moving mm -hmm. um, we ended up at the cocos um, went in there and uh, basically just hit out there we went upstairs mm -hmm. we went upstairs in their uh storage storage room and we all hung out in there and just tried to hide and stay up there stay okay Okay, I'm gonna have them before you start your statements. I'm gonna have them check out right here. And basically, you met these people at Coco's and got a ride here. Yes. Okay. It All right. This happens. They live in the same city as us. Okay. Thank All right. You. Go ahead and I'm gonna have these people talk to you real quick, and then we'll do the statements. Okay. okay.